Hello, I hope you guys are all doing great. This is the nail art design we're going to be working on today. What I'm using here is the nail foils. This particular pattern is called cashmere gold and the way I applied it on my nails is just on certain areas. So what we're going to need here is going to be the adhesive where we're going to apply it over certain areas only and I'm going to be going over it twice because this foil isn't very forgiving and then after that there's still going to be little spaces we need to do retouches on and I'm going to show you how to do that. Let's get started. The first thing to do is apply your background color. As a background color I chose a dark brown. The next thing to do is apply your foil adhesive. First you need to decide exactly where you're going to want to place your foil. Now we will allow about 5 minutes to pass by for our foil adhesive to dry clear. As you can see there the foil adhesive has dried clear. Now we're ready to apply the foil. I'm going to get my foil and I'm going to lay it flat on my nail. And I'm just going to start pressing down. And this particular foil I noticed that there was a lot of empty spaces so I'll probably have to go over it again twice and um, one thing that you can do with this nail foil also is that if you wear a background color that's very similar and I'll show you what I'm talking about right now um, you won't have to go over it twice because it could be forgiving if you use uh, the same color background so all I'm doing here is pressing down over all the little corners. Okay, I'm going to press down. Okay, and I think I'm ready to remove it already. So I'm going to go very lightly all around. I'm doing the little corners. Okay. Okay. So I'm going to pull it out and as you can see there, there's a lot of spaces that still need to be um, filled in. One thing that you can do is uh, you can get a background color, for example this nail polish here. Look at how similar that is in color. So all I would have to do would be apply over those areas this color and then it would be even. Or you can have this one as a background color, but because I'm wearing such a dark background color, um, the best thing to do is reapply the foil adhesive, which I'm going to do right now so I can show you how to do that. And I'm only going to apply it over the areas um, where I'm going to need to redo it again. So all I'm doing is placing that. Now I'm going to move over to the bottom and do the same thing. Okay, so I'm just going to allow that to dry, give it another five minutes, and then I'll go in and replace the foil. Now that the nail foil adhesive has dried, I'm going to reapply the foil on the areas where it needs a little more of the foil. So all I'm going to do is apply the foil, just rubbing it around, and if there's any spaces left, I'll show you exactly what I did with this particular foil. So all I'm doing there is just rubbing it. Okay, and I'm going to be carefully removing it. Okay. And if there's any spots left, I'm going to show you exactly um, what I did. And you can see, still see that there's a couple of spots left there. First I'm going to do the bottom one again. Okay. So I'm going to be placing that one down, laying it flat, and rubbing it on the bottom area as well. So some of these foils aren't very forgiving and they're a little bit difficult to apply. But there's always something to be done. So I'm going to remove this. 
okay and it covered a little more but you can still see some areas there so the best thing to do or what I did to some of my nails is I'm gonna get the polish that matches the foil almost exactly so I'm, what I'm gonna do is I'm going to thin out my brush as thin as I can thin it out just removing all excess that the brush only has a little bit of polish left and I'm just going to redo little retouches over those particular areas. Okay. As you can see there, all the little spots have been filled. That's what I had to do to most of my nails. I applied the foil twice and then I did the little retouches with the similar nail polish color that you see there. The next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to get a nail art polish in gold and I'm going to be outlining the area where I applied the nail foil and I did it in a swervy manner so I'm just going to be trying to follow the lines. Now I'm going to be applying four 1mm size rhinestones in the brown polished area. And that's it for this nail art design. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. Be safe and I'll see you next time. Bye.